much and we move on to our next presenter, Mr. Vinod Tiwari from Power Ledger. So, good afternoon, everyone, and uh, really glad to be back in Delhi and, and also uh, in the company of our partners uh, and lots of potential partners down there. Uh, just a quick uh, overview on uh, who we are. Our names have already been mentioned a couple of times uh, by Hazrail and a uh, uh, few other presenters. Uh, Power Ledger is an Australian company, it's a software company. Uh, we use blockchain for spinning off marketplaces, uh, for uh, transactive energy, environmental commodity trading, uh, and also for renewable energy asset financing. And uh, in my presentation today, uh, I've been asked to run through uh, our deployments, our journey so far. Uh, uh, we started three and a half years ago uh, with a couple of proof of concepts in Australia. Now have a footprint uh, in 10 countries uh, and growing. So we have obviously figured out the use cases for blockchain. Uh, um, it is uh, obviously the company of energy professionals. Uh, we didn't start uh, with the premise that uh, we have blockchain as technology and go looking for use cases. But we already knew where, uh, uh, how the energy markets are uh, transitioning from the grid that we look at uh, to, to this. And being in Australia, we, were at the, we are at the bleeding edge uh, where we're seeing the high proliferation of distributed energy resources. Uh, and therefore, the need for integrating these uh, DERs, uh, like solar PV, batteries, home energy storage systems, uh, and even community batteries, et cetera, uh, into the main mix of uh, uh, this transitioning uh, world of energy. Uh, as uh, our electricity market operator and electricity market commission, AEMC in Australia, calls it, uh, the world's moving to two-way uh, trans, uh, uh, two-way tra transfer of energy, one at the wholesale level and one at the distributed level. And this distributed level is where uh, you need the integration and solution and we feel blockchain comes in at a, as a great tool uh, to provide multiple solutions. And I will talk about uh, the solutions that we have created. Uh, obviously, we've, uh, one of the solutions is around peer-to-peer -peer energy trading where we've uh, literally converted the physical grid into energy trading platform. And uh, broadly speaking, we can uh, segment our uh, product solutions into three categories. Uh, one of them is transactive energy that includes peer-to-peer -peer energy trading. Could be across the grid or uh, in an embedded network behind the grid. Uh, virtual power plants and also solutions around electric vehicle. Uh, and the other distinct uh, category obviously being uh, uh, environmental commodity trading. So we have renewable energy certificates. Uh, Mr. Agarwal mentioned uh, uh, as a great use case, and we are working uh, in the United States. Uh, we're one of the major uh, renewable energy players in that space in uh, creating end-to-end -end solution using blockchain for uh, registry uh, and also removing the inefficiencies of uh, renewable energy credit trading, uh, you know, eliminating middlemen, uh, and bringing on uh, transactions at, at much faster speed. And also utilizing, which this is uh, the number two uh, financing of renewable energy assets, uh, is under development. We haven't launched this product. Uh, it, is, it is fully ready, but we haven't launched it for, uh, we're still kind of figuring out uh, the regulatory hurdles around, uh, uh, around this product space. Why blockchain? Uh, well, blockchain, obviously, uh, when we're talking about, let's say, energy trading transactions at peer-to-peer -peer level, uh, you're looking at uh, uh, need for having uh, a source of truth, uh, a self-auditing mechanism, uh, uh, or a mechanism that is able to settle microtransactions at speed. Blockchain fits in uh, extremely well in, in all those uh, transactions, trading easily, uh, making environmental commodity market easier as well. Uh, this slide pretty much depicts uh, how we, we work with, uh, uh, with the data, uh, and, uh, and one of the the beauty of our solution is that it is purely a software-based solution, so we do not need any additional special metering infrastructure or uh, uh, hardware uh, gateway devices to be deployed on site. So we take the data from smart meter. Uh, obviously, you need to have a mechanism to transfer the data to the platform and then create trading logic algorithms to enable those trades. Uh, the solution X grid uh, or U grid, both are uh, related with peer-to-peer -peer energy trading. Uh, what these do is, uh, uh, at the back end, you know, when the data is uh, uh, collected, 
It enables the creating a digital exchange for uh, buying and selling of energy. And uh, we enable, uh, through dynamic pricing uh, mechanism, uh, the pricing can be, buyers and sellers can set their buying and selling pricing. The highest buy price and the lowest selling price gets cleared first. Uh, and it is flexible enough where uh, prosumers and consumers can set their, you know, if they want to be very active in this little market space, they can keep changing their price every 30 minutes, every five minutes, whatever is the frequency of settlement. Uh, or if they want a low-touch uh, interaction, they can just set and forget, uh, and the, the platform deals with it. VPP, and I'd like to probably spend just a couple of minutes here. It was mentioned earlier as well. Uh, when you start to reach a high penetr penetration of rooftop solar, the natural progression from there is uh, batteries, because you go, will have to deal with the reverse flow of energy. And Australia is already seeing that. Uh, we've hit about 27 to 30 percent uh, rooftop penetration in uh, at the residential level. So there are many suburbs, new suburbs, where uh, every second house is, uh, is with rooftop solar. So what happens in during uh, you know, 12 to 2, 3 p.m., uh, there's a lot of reverse flow of energy. So you're going to need uh, energy storage devices to, uh, to deal with the reverse flows uh, um, so that the infrastructure uh, at the substation level doesn't need to be substantially enhanced. Uh, and. Uh, that enables uh, solutions like virtual power plant where you can uh, aggregate distributed batteries and, uh, and then do multiple services. Uh, you can uh, use these uh, aggregated distributed batteries for energy arbitrage or uh, grid services like active reactive power management or even if you have enough of them, you can uh, support the grid for balancing uh, through frequency control ancillary services as well. So where Power Ledger acts as the bottom layer here is uh, we facilitate the value transfer uh, for uh, the asset owners. Uh, clearly, there will be times when it will be beneficial for them to, to actually not use the energy from their own storage device, but uh, enable the dispatch of that battery in the wholesale market and monetize it. Uh, we enable that monetization in, uh, instantly or in near real time. Uh, we I talked about uh, solutions in uh, environmental commodity trading. Uh, we call it C6 and C6 Plus, uh, where uh, uh, we're, uh, we're able to sort of uh, create renewable energy credit trading mechanism. I'll quickly run through, uh, uh, because we're not only, uh, you know, in the process of developing these products, we're actually deploying these products. So uh, the 10 countries, we started, uh, the first major project was uh, at the commercial level uh, in uh, Bangkok. Uh, Hazril has visited that as well. Uh, a precinct, a gated precinct with a shopping center, and uh, international school, three apartment blocks, uh, uh, and uh, dental hospital trading energy with each other. That's our x -grid deployment. We are about to deploy uh, a big solution at Chiang Mai University, where about uh, close to 12 megawatt of solar PV will be installed on rooftop buildings of the university and creating a trading environment and, and also utilizing batteries for uh, some virtual power plant capability as well. Uh, second largest utility of Japan, Kepco, uses our solution. Uh, we did first uh, pilot with them for peer-to-peer uh, -peer energy trading and then uh, now progressing with uh, re renewable energy credit trading because Japan, again, is being uh, one of those markets where there is a transition taking place. They're moving away from premium feed-in tariff to uh, to zero feed-in tariff, so all these rooftop solar, uh, rooftop <coughs> asset owners uh, are now looking at uh, ways to monetize uh, how, how best to sell uh, their uh, rooftop energy. Energy steer mark in Austria, we've done a similar project with them as well at peer-to-peer -peer trading level. Uh, now we've completed the project, uh, now looking at the business model to deploy it commercially. In US, uh, in Pennsylvania, American PowerNet, Again, a peer-to-peer -peer energy trading uh, project uh, where uh, their headquarters uh, has uh, substantial rooftop solar. Excess energy is being traded with their neighbors uh, using our platform. Clearway North America is our joint development partner for uh, renewable energy credit trading platform. Uh, and uh, we are about to launch this uh, uh, very soon at a commercial level, uh, which will, uh, because US alone is uh, uh, more than $3 billion <coughs> market for uh, compliance uh, renewable energy credits or renewable energy certificates. Uh, so blockchain uh, users have been identified by others as well. Uh, we have actually deployed it uh, and we're taking it to the commercial level. 
Sustainable Engine Development Authority. Proud to be partners with um, Hazril and his team, uh, where we have been chosen to be partnering with them at national level uh, pilot project. Uh, and hopefully the learnings will come out of it very soon and uh, this gets into uh, a policy making decision for uh, Malaysia as well. Uh, multiple other projects and I will rush through some of these. Uh, we're working at smart cities level in, uh, in Australia uh, and uh, also at apartment level as well. So this is just giving you a depth of uh, solution where it can be deployed. Uh, and also in the urban precincts as well, like shopping centers. The owners of shopping centers can have uh, uh, you know, fill up their roof space, one, two, three megawatt, whatever that allows, uh, and deal with their tenants using blockchain platform uh, for uh, various type of solutions. Uh, our latest project is in uh, north of Italy with Alperia, uh, where we'll be looking at uh, multiple solutions as well, uh, including energy trading at peer-to-peer -peer level, plus uh, provenance tracking. Uh, and provenance tracking is uh, on the electric vehicle side of things. Uh, uh, I will probably rush through these. Uh, Power Club is our VPP project, the first commercial launch uh, uh, where we are going to be aggregating multiple batteries uh, and working in consortium with uh, energy retailer, uh, systems integrator for uh, sys batteries and solar to enable the maximum optimum return for uh, the owners of uh, these rooftop, uh, these uh, distributed energy resources. So three and a half years ago, with one proof of concept in Western Australia, we've now grown a footprint uh, across the world and uh, very proud to be, have partnered for the project uh, for uh, UPPCL as well with ISGF. Uh, we will be you know, very soon uh, uh, deploying that or uh, you know, selecting the sites and getting into the deployment mode as well. Uh, and also we recently completed uh, with BRPL a uh, desktop trial as well, so this is our uh, foray into India and looking forward to, uh, we, India is a huge market, huge market potential. We are obviously in conversation with multiple stakeholders here and looking forward to taking it uh, uh, in India in a big way. This is what we want to be, to be a major contributor to transforming energy markets globally and Paris climate change uh, impacting billion people. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, uh, Vinod. I think that's a lot of uh, case studies and uh, experience that I think each project needs one session uh, for us to learn from. So, uh, but I am sure uh, our um, audience will uh, take the opportunity to um, find you offline and uh, take more details from you.